Hello and welcome to my Mountain of Shame. Today we have the 2015 game Sabelle, which according to the Steam page seems to be an FMV game. However, there must be more to it because there's definitely some art here as well. Interestingly enough, when I tried to launch the game, it said it was a missing EXE, but when I went into the directory, there was in fact an EXE. I then couldn't record it straight away, so I had to uh, basically close it up and open it up again, and then finally it would start adding, doing it. So, uh, okay. Sure. Why not? So, last time I recorded a first full motion video game, I had just came off a game I really, really hated. And I felt bad because it led to me making a very snarky video in the Late Shift video. It wasn't a bad video and I still had fun. I thought it was actually a pretty good game, all things considered. But I do admit, I did not give it as much of a fair shake as I should have. Now, I'd love to say I'm in a bad position right now, but this is me coming off playing the Marooners, which basically um, was a five minute long video where I had to do nothing but edit out my name. And it took me longer to edit the, well, edit the video, obviously, but longer to get the video edited out in total than it did actually recording the game in the first place. Okay, that's probably a lie. It probably didn't take that long either. But, 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 point is, I'm still in a better place than I was last time, so we're fine. So, I'm going to try my hardest to not be so jaded when I play Sabelle. But we'll see what this game's about, shall we? Doesn't seem to be any options, there's only subtitles or exit. So let's go straight in and see what happens. The music stopped. Now this is a 2015 game, um, developed by StarMade Games. Apparently based in February 2009. Yeah. Triforce. I Got some anime pictures in the background. Alright, so. A very feminine looking background here for us. What can we do? Can I click on anything? Oh! Okay, so the first thing I clicked on was actually a game. Va Valt Mari. Okay. Oh, last night. Hey Nina, I saw Todd and Mal making out at the party last night that you skipped. I know that online game guy, but come on, skipping parties for him. Stop skipping parties for him. Please come out with me tonight so we can address this new development in our totally fucked up friends group. I can't believe they made out, XOXO Becca. I mean, no, because like clearly there's a guy in the video game that I care about. Oh, I've got pictures. I've got pictures of, of someone kissing a girl, and then I've got Brit and me. Aww. It got Brit. Mum apartment, 1991. That's a while back. Pretty, fair enough. And itchy. Okay, so that must be all my friends, I suppose. Fair enough. And some memories. Is that Mum apartment, 1991? Oh, I thought it had Mum in it, but no, just the apartment. Specifically, why would I take a picture of their apartment? Okay. So before we go back in here, I want to explore everything else on this girl's computer, because we can. So, we got a computer, recent photo post. Ah, me and my first computer, I can't believe I found this picture. I mean, fair, I've also got a similarly bad picture of me and my first computer. So, my first computer, but eight, one of my first computers I ever used. And we've got some poems. Nina Friedman. <laughs> oh dear, fair enough. Fair enough, how old is this lady, this girl meant to be? I'm guessing probably 16, 17. Oh, we got Kawaii. Kawaii has perished. Press spacebar to continue. The party is over. Press spacebar to continue. Seriously, get out. Press spacebar to continue. Heaven is a place on Habbo Hotel, but not on Earth. Heaven is definitely not on the bus. It's on Philly. It's on the Matrix. I'd rather go to the Matrix than Heaven anyway. I mean, fair. Also, the pool's closed, so we're not going to um we're not going to uh, Habbo Hotel either. I drink most of Rob's ginger ale to a three-day run of alcohol-infused dehydration. This is edgy-ish, I guess. So, prom. So, that would imply that um, 
she's been to prom, meaning she'd be 17 or 18. Probably, I would imagine 18, because that's the sort of thing these games are. Got old car, okay. The neck, Russell Orton. I mean, I gotta say, this girl's done a fantastic job at setting up a computer properly with um, icons for everything. Uh, weird skin over it. I don't think it's Apple. I mean, it might be Apple, I suppose. I, it might be meant to be Apple. I don't know. NYC, first day. That's what. So she moved to NYC. Or maybe she went to a holiday at NYC, actually. Yeah, that could be a holiday. Actually, yes. 285. Horrible pictures. This girl is really bad at taking pictures. I mean, I know camera quality was worse back then, but come on. Um, chat log February. Ooh, here's the juicy stuff. Becca, what happened? Ended up happening last night. You never texted me after like 1 a.m. Oh, geez. I went home with that 23 year old Bron guy from Linear Algebra. <laughs> wow. Itchy's 22 too. 23 too. Oh, that Valtamari guy? I thought he was our age. Okay, so that. Let's just bring up the picture of this itchy guy so we've got a picture for this one. Um, so if I go in here and get the picture of Itchy, which was this one, I believe. Oops, let's close that. Itchy, there we go. So we now got a picture of this guy as a reference. And we let's get a picture of, let's see, Brit and me. This is Becca, so it's not Brit. Okay. Uh, nah, did you have sex? Obviously, it was a little awkward though. I, I bit the inside of my cheek while we were on his couch eating some snacks. And he was like, ow. And I was like, what's wrong? And I said, I hurt my mouth. And he said, you want me to make it feel better? And I was like, LOL, what? In my head, obvious, but obviously in real life, I said something dumb. I forgot, like, but like, could you be more obvious? LOL, he kissed me. Oh my God, amazing. LOL, LOL, LOL. What was the sex like? I'm so jealous. I want to have sex too. Don't tell me you've never had sex before. I have not. Oh my god, we had to talk about this. I have class now, though. I'll come to your dorm after. Okay, so clearly it's a few years later. They must be at university. Well, at least maybe one year later. So maybe maybe 18. I would imagine 18, 19. Okay, so that was how long ago? No, that was the most recent one. Yeah, so the 17th for the second. This is a little bit older. Are you free on the 20th? I'm throwing a party. Hey, you there? Can you come to my party? Uh, sorry, I was playing a game. Valtimeri, I assume. Yep. So, party. Want to come help me set up? I can't tonight. Sorry. Why? Uh, a new Valtimeri stage is coming out. I know. I suck. <sighs> Leave you room for once, Nina. Jesus Christ. Okay. Nina, okay. I looked at the itchy guy's picture, and he's pretty hot. I get it now. I know. I, it's super weird because we've known each other for a while, but we only started talking a lot recently. He sent me that picture and I was like, what? You're hot? I didn't tell him that though. I'm too shy. But wow, he's so cute and I'm dying. Are you still talking to him a lot? Yeah, we've been doing runs in Veltmari alone. He usually goes to a big group. Uh, he goes with a big group. So I'm pretty surprised he wants to hang out with just me. Oh, that's cute. I know. It's good. Ah. Okay, so we've got some minor chat luggage going on. Okay, what else do we have here? Well, we've got selfies. Got misc. So we looked through the misc folder already. Yes. There's a website here which has fan art, Mel's fan art, Brit's fan art. Okay. Oh, God. This is, this is so, like, typical of that particular... Of that age group, of that age bracket. Like, I was on the receiving end of a few people drawing that sort of fan art. Um, of people like, look at my fan art, I made the XYZ game. So yeah, this is accurate. Hi, hi. I know I haven't been posting that much. I'm in my last year of high school, so things have been pretty busy. I think I'm going to get good grades, though. So I'm in. So yeah, um, 2008 is when she graduated. So she would have been 17 then, 18 now, I assume. I assume. Well, I think it could be America. I don't know when America's graduation is, but fair enough. So yes, I'm in an awesome independent study with Mrs. Faust. I'm reading Madame Bovary and Anne Catanina with her. They're such good voice books. Anyways, I wanted to post because Mel and Britt have sent me some of their old fan art. I'm going to post it on here as soon as I scan, I think. I love old sketchbooks. Maybe I'll go through those and find out some of my old stuff. It's a lot of Sailor Moon and Final Fantasy fan art. Of course, LOL. I kind of miss drawing fan art and writing fan fiction. 
That's it for now. Hopefully I'll start to upgrade the site soon. Ta-ta. Nina. Nina. And then... <laughs> I'm Okay, there we go. Oh, there we go. We finally found her, her birthday. So she's born in 1990. Um, 19 soon. So she's 18 turning 19. Born in 1990 in March 15. So, yep. Just a little inventor. Nina. Nina. Sorry. Color blue. You couldn't tell it from her computer bubbly and she's moved to NYC so it wasn't just a holiday it wasn't there okay update recently so this is a little bit later how long is it after this so it's a few months after so three months later after this post about posting more it's then sorry for very posting anymore I've been busy now outside college I hope that art can start updating this again once my homework load settles down I'm super distracted by Valtamari as usual haha <laughs> anyways I'm on hiatus now be back soon okay so in the old layout, okay. Blog background, fair enough. Archive profile. Bluey side pajamas eating NA, drinking NA. Uh, Ayami, no more words. Holes, Mara Harabu. Seeing Kate, feeling sad. Look at my personal site, lostmemories.net. So about me, I'm a girl, I'm 13. My name is Nina. I'm from the USA. I love do doing web design and watching animes. You could say I'm nice, intelligent dreamer. And sometimes I guess I think I can be too nice. You know, I'm blonde with blue and green and uh, blue green. I think they look gray eyes, but I guess that's all I have to say. Okay. We got posts from back then. Oh God. See, this is, this is, I am. I'm sorry. If you're not interested in going through everything, everything included, I, I will do this. I need to do this. Okay. Sorry. Uh, all right. <sighs> Another boring day. Not boring once I think about it. Okay, things look... The funny thing today, my friend once sent a little high note to this kid who kept looking at us. My friend asked a guy who was sitting near him to give him a note, and I couldn't hear the name, so he kept saying these random names. And me and my friend were cracking up, but then he finally got the name, and my face was red, and I laughed so hard. I was really hot. My friend kept bugging me. I was blushing. It was funny, and I was really, really annoying. Also, at lunch, I thought I took a corn muffin and blueberry muffin, but no blueberries. I, I gotta get do with my homework. Ta-ta! Nina giggled it. At eight twenty-nine. Yesterday I had no homework. It was nice. Then I had to go to the orthodontist, and she said the next appointment I get my braces off. I've been waiting for so long for this. I can barely wait a little longer. I played Final Fantasy X two, and I saw Gipple again. He said, "Yeah, me and Riku make quite the couple." Riku totally freaked out. It was hilarious. But now I'm thinking something went on between them in the past when when Pauline pointed out that how defensive Riku was acting towards Riku. He's trying to convince Uni. <laughs> LOL. They was lying. Ah, I gotta get on the bus now. Nina ran to the bus at 6.52 a.m. Oh my god, I finally got Final Fantasy X2! It's so awesome. The new battle system is great and I really like how light and funny both the music and how the story is starting out. I personally prefer Final Fantasy VIII for myself. Me, Mel, and Britt all went to the mail to get the flyers that FSX2 is coming out on the 19th, and I think some people go buy it tomorrow. We got before they had a normal guide in special edition for like $30. They can get us a free post of Yuna, Riku, and Payne on its wall next to it's on my wall next right next to TV. If I were I to play Final Fantasy X2 later, later I went to their house and played it. It was fun. Hey, I know I've been working on the Blinky for my name to use a signature at the end of each bla um, blog entry, you know? Uh, my, blo my blog entry is boring because Butterfly Wishes Reviews said that my blog in in try in entries could use more emotion. I don't always like, like write about all that stuff because, like, what if someone in my school came and saw and got their feelings hurt or something and I got them mad? I don't want that to happen. Sigh. Asterix, sigh, asterix. Well, gotta go now. Ta-ta. Nina breathed at 6.50 p.m. I hope she breathed more than just that. Okay, now the entries get all the problems I've been having off my back. Just to let you know, I've been hanging out with this friend a lot, you see. She's pretty skinny cheery cheerleader. She went to water country country later late, late yesterday, and let's just say all the boys are flirting with her. We were, we were standing, stand there. We were at a stand there, and she said to me, I really want that hat. The guy man manning the one of the games was wearing the hat, and, said, and she was talking to him about. So he said, oh, you must like this hat, and he gives me the hat. So this may be a bit sad. You see, I've always had bad luck when it comes to guys. I don't think I'm very pretty, and I don't think I flirt with very much, but my friend does a lot. And of course, I envy her. I don't want to seem jealous, but, you know, that would sound bad. She even has all these guys who are, like, really into her, and it makes me think about how hopeless and alone I am in life. I've never had a boyfriend, and when... Almost all the other friends have. My parents don't have enough time to care about me, and now I have no 
friends, like the one friend I would sit with at lunch, but there was that one, this one girl. Huh. Well, I'm not to watch TV. I'm getting stride and stressed. So bye bye. Sigh. Another boring day. Not that boring. Once I think about. It. Um, never really done that one. Sorry, I've been busy to vlog the last couple of days. Friday, I did... Um, I forget. Sa Saturday, Val slept over, and Sunday, I felt sick and just played PS FFX2 all day. The sleepover was awful, and I felt so bad for Val. When one my one my PC PS2 broke, and two of my parents got into a big argument. I don't want to know what it's about, and how many times I apologized to her. I was so mad at my parents, I was shaking, but oh yeah, later, I did fix my PS2. <sighs> Sigh. I got so worried, like, I had no emotional expressions on my face. I was so devastated. The reason I was so devastated is because I didn't have a don't have DVD player, so my expensive DVD sets would go to waste, and also I spent a lot of time getting my FFX2, X2, and I was wicked happy it was fixed, though. I think the reason I got sick on Sunday was because Saturday was stressing me out. I thought that the PS2 player actually was a DVD. Oh, I see. I didn't have a DVD player. Sets would go to waste, so she's saying I can't if my PS2 is broken, I couldn't play it. Fair enough. Today I went into Melon Brits and played some Final Fantasy X2, and then we watched Star Wars Episode 2. We got super hyper. We were jumping everywhere on the couch on each other. It was very funny. Ooh, I can't wait for Thanksgiving. All the food will soon be so good. Well, I need to go do homework now, so ta-ta! And I jumped off the walls at 8.05 p.m. Okay. Now let's look at these pictures. <laughs> yep. I feel like Oh, there. <laughs> Old picture. New hair. Yeah, I mean fair, fair. High school. Bed. Cute. Wow. Oh, please don't be any nudes in here. I feel they they wouldn't have have that on on um <laughs> on or on a video game on Steam. No, thankfully. Um. Okay. Wait, does it say 2 on it? Hmm, okay. That means 22 is in 2022, so. Uh, then we've got some anime and some rooms, okay. And we've got a really old image of her in a classroom with some very old computers. So I wonder if these are actual real pictures from this, from whoever made this game's past. And it does say the designer is Nina Freeman, so. It definitely sounds like it's it's probably a bit of a, um a self sort of character thing that they've got going on here, which is interesting. So she's writing her own story, which is fair. Well, I guess we've got to log into the game. I can't, um, I spent 17 minutes of this, of this, just looking at all the files on the desktop, which I'm sure is riveting, riveting content for all of you. But let's just jump straight in and be happy we didn't find anything weird. <sighs> all right, let's log in as Sabelle into server Medusa. Someone who found love on World of Warcraft, clearly. Incoming from Itchy, click to answer. Hey, what's up? Let's just private chat. Sick of all these fuckers on the main channel. <laughs> yeah, everyone's pretty rowdy today. They're all spazzing because Bulldog Hell is coming out tonight. They're gonna go line up at whatever store, which fucking sucks because now we can't do anything serious tonight. Uh, yeah. Okay. Gotta say, he just sounds like a rude asshole, really, but fair enough. I don't think I'd ever talk with that much swearing, um, even when I was his age. I mean, he's 24, so, like, he's a lot older than she is, but, like, she's he's really acting a little bit, eh, I guess that's how it is sometimes, especially in these little games. Uh, and I did play MMOs. I used to play a lot of uh, free-to-play um, Korean star ones like um, Dream of Mirror, Fly for Fun, that sort of stuff. We should talk on the phone sometime. Oh, yeah, let's catch up. Oh, I can reply. Uh, I'm kind of surprised. Wait, what? What? The, the... Okay, so we don't get any choice. Gotta wait for it. All right. Hey, girl. How are things? Been pretty busy lately. Ampula has been doing a lot lately. Every guy's bowing to Oshi's whip, as usual, I see. Oh my god, Guyver, stop. Are you seriously defending him? He's an ass. I agree. He is an ass. Hey, want to come do an early one for me on Friday? Okay, see you then, girl. Itchy usually comes on then, but... Uh, it comes... Usually comes. But let's go, just this girl's night. Yes, I have so much fun. I want to talk about it with you. Okay. Hey, where you at? I'm sorry. I'm with Itchy right now. Oh my god, you're always with Itchy. Come on. 
Sorry, let's hang tomorrow. I want to hang now. Can can meet you after his his or something? Hey, really, you know what Ichi and I are doing? Ugh, his entire life is itchy. Something happened. I need your opinion on something right now. Oh, uh, you know? Okay, so I'm just gonna keep managing this. I've got can make responses, and I can. Okay, so basically, I've got to just keep managing my chat and playing a very basic game by the looks of it, or just clicking around. I mean, I like what they've done here. The clicking, even the voice chat is pretty cool. I do hope this isn't going to be a story of abuse, which it easily could be. There are some really horrible people on, online sometimes. And it's itchy, I suppose. What happened if I went to a different... Uh... What happened if I went to a different server? Oh my god, who is it? Gilly? Itchy? Yeah, we'll talk on Friday. Okay, let's make a happy face back, I suppose. It's a very basic game, clearly. Ooh, it says I have something I can do. Hey, hi, you going to Bulldog Hell release tonight? I don't want to go alone. By the way, when are you, why aren't you turning 19 in a few weeks? When are we playing the party? Let's keep doing the game as we go. Bulldog Hell, pre-order now. 18 plus, nine, fair enough. Looks like a pretty cool game. Yeah, I said no problem with playing another game. I don't need to just play one game. Can I respond to it? No, I can't, okay. Ah, oh, attack game is, yes, yes, I'm coming, oh God. <laughs> Very funny. I barely even play other games anymore, honestly. Me neither. They're all crap anyways. It makes me kind of sad though. I like playing through good story games. Yes, you should. They all have expiration dates. You play for 60 hours and that's it. Yeah, exactly. You can play it for a long time without worrying that you have to find some new shit to buy. Yeah. But I mean, the time you get out of an online game like this is a lot more. And you get to meet people. Yeah, I don't like most of the people I meet in here, though. Except for, like, you and a few others. I just like running shit. Like, making people get organized for some fight or whatever. The big battles where everything's dependent on your ability to find the right guys to do the job. That's what I like. Okay, so I've got to say, um, A, that's a terrible way of looking at it. I do prefer story games. Like, don't get me wrong, I like multiplayer games too. But if you're just grinding like this, it's kind of, you know. <laughs> You've been leading this ampule since it started, right? No, some other dude was, but he quit. And he was crap anyways. We didn't become good until I whipped everyone's ass into shape. People really do listen to you. It's kind of amazing. I'm just really straightforward. Like, if people don't listen to me and then they fuck up, I make sure that they know they fucked up. You gotta get in people's faces. That just That's sounds aggressive. Uh, I don't know if they respect or fear you. I'm glad I haven't messed up that bad yet. <laughs> I'm never gonna yell at you. Uh, but still, don't be an idiot. You... Wouldn't yell at me? No. Really? I'm not gonna yell at a cute girl. <laughs> I'm not cute. <laughs> I don't think I am. But that's really nice of you. Hey, I know what you look like. You posted a picture of yourself on the forums. I mean... I know. That's a pretty flattering photo, though. You should... Send me a different picture, and then I can really decide if I think you're cute. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that just sounds like he's asking for nudes. I don't, I don't like where this is going. Hmm. Yeah, he's a girl. Exactly. I agree. This guy is a player. There are plenty of them online. 
I am so not photogenic. You definitely are. I'm not photogenic. I look like a fucking ghost. <laughs> I thought you looked really nice in that photo you posted. You don't have to lie. I'll still like you even if you admit that I look like a ghost. <laughs> no. Yes, come on. Have you seen Guile? He's like a fucking bodybuilder. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I I don't like this. I don't like where this is going. Fair enough. I mean, I like the game though. It's quite fun. See, are you in NIC right now? I'm gonna go there for a soccer game. Want to meet up, Gil? I don't know. He's like attractive, but not really my type. You know? I don't know. Dude's got perks. <laughs> Ew. I like when guys are more lean. I guess I fit that profile. <laughs> I guess so. Hmm. What do you like? About girls? Yeah. I think he's the best likes anyone. I like uh, curvy, skinny girls. Not like fat girls. I, I just like them when they're not rail thin, you know? Girls gotta have some meat. <laughs> hmm. I wish I was skinnier. No way, you lose your boobs. <laughs> uh, I guess so. Seriously, you have to know that you've got a nice rack. Come on. Uh. <laughs> I mean, people have told me that before, but as they should. <laughs> oh, don't know how to take a compliment. <laughs> I really don't. I'm gonna just have to keep giving you compliments until you get used to it. <laughs> That'd be completely impossible, honestly. But you can give it a shot. Done? Deal. <laughs> <laughs> this is the silliest. What are we even doing right now? Being friends and whacking stuff online. I think I've already made one decision about this. It's not a good game to necessarily play for because I really don't have that much time I can actually chat, you know? Or say what I'm thinking. I don't like this guy, though. He, he's robbing me the wrong way. So, how about that picture? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I can send you one if you want. I'll have to take it first, though. Okay. Don't get me wrong, it's very interesting and in, in stuff, and I definitely want to play more of this game in general. It's silly, but... And I mean, this is definitely showing why these games aren't fun, you know? Oh, here we go. Camera distracted. Connected all new cameras. Oh, okay. Is that what I saw? Okay, look at you. Alright. Well, I thought I did that, but okay. Ugh, yeah. I never know what to wear when I take pictures of myself, though. I get so self conscious. You can literally wear anything, and I'll still probably like the picture. <laughs> really? I mean, not anything. Seriously. Okay. Wick, wear a propeller hat. Just of me standing there, so maybe I'll take more of a close up this time. Yes, please. And you're doing this while you're playing games? Nice hit. I mean, it's an interesting game. It's interesting, um, interesting setup, and I would definitely want to play it myself more. But I do feel like it may not be the sort of game you'd want to watch a whole video of. If you do, though, I can find out how long this video is and this game is, and give you the option of um, playing it. 
Oh, or with me playing it. Yes, I got the last hit on that boss. Okay, here we go. I mean, not wearing pants, that's realistic. Okay, um... Don't take a picture like that straight away. Come on, dude. Oh, damn. Lady. Oh, dear. He said a picture. You, you, you can see wearing anything and you're just going to go straight for that. Oh, boy. Yeah, this this yeah, okay. I see where that's gonna progress. Ooh, so now we got more Oh! Oh okay! I got more files I can explore! Ah! Oh, ah, oh, look at all the things I can go to! Oh fantastic! Fantastic! There's stuff I can look at! Oh, 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 yeah, that, um, that escalated quickly. Gotcha. That escalated very, very quickly. Okay. Ahem. Ahem. Excuse me. Also, uh, filter. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. Hmm. Guy taking, taking advantage of the girl's low self-esteem to get, her to, get him to send uh, nude photos. That's, uh, that's not pleasant, um, in the slightest. Uh, well, I mean, at least he's not gone full nude, I suppose, but, um, still, okay. Anything else changed since last time we've been here besides these photos? Probably not. Let's see, what was the high school would have changed? Miscellaneous plus blog. So, ooh, we got a few more things here. Send to mom. Oh. Happy birthday. That almost looks like a hospital. Okay. Weird. Chat logs in April. Okay, this is more chat logs. Okay, look, I'll be honest. You probably don't care to watch me go through and look at all of this stuff. But if you do, tell me. I will not play. I will not continue playing this game until, I, until I've heard one way or another from you guys. If you want me to do more, go for it. Tell me. I'll play more, as awkwardly strange as this game seems to be. But... Otherwise, I'll just play it on my own sometime. It's, uh, I'm a little bit concerned about where it's going. The thing about relationships like this is they definitely, um, oh. Oh, dear. Um, they definitely end up with people being hurt. And I have a very bad thought that maybe it's going to end with her committing suicide or him sharing nudes of her or pictures around I, I don't know this is itchy yeah I I just know a lot of these these sort of relationships can go pretty interestingly oh wait she's already given up on her so for a brief overview yeah okay actress sort of girl is, is she given up on her? Ooh, okay, I've got to read her anime list before we go there. All right, Sailor Moon. I mean, sure enough, you're, you're eight, seven, yep. Same with Shakura, Chobits. I mean, they all just sound like typical animes for um, this demographic. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I've actually watched Magic Knife Rayef. I think I watched that at one point. Fruits Basket, yes. Uh, Full Moon, Wasa, Gashinma, no. Uh, pitchy, pitchy, pitch. Nope, nope, nope. I don't know about this. These Hitty Kitty Great I've heard of. Angelic Layer I've seen, I think. Though it was kind of girly, but I guess that makes sense. Um, Pokemon, obviously fantastic. Scrap Princess. Oh, I love Scrap Princess. Pre tier. Or in High School Host Club. Also phenomenal. That was a great game. Um, okay. Misty from Pokemon. Yuffie from Final Fantasy. Riku from Final Fantasy X. Yeah, fair, fair. Interests. So, all I'm worried about is, did she, wait, say Phantom of the Opera? 
Oh, I did. Good call. Good call. Phantom's great. Okay, I've got to read for interest too. Acting, theater, movies, photography, Adobe Photoshop, anime, fairy tales, web design, mythology, video games, Disney. Yeah, fair. Um, basically, I love video games. These in particular, Crash Bandicoot, Dance Dance Revolution. I don't know if she'd like Beat Saber nowadays. Probably. Uh, Final Fantasy series, Final Fantasy X. Fair enough. Final Fantasy X too. Obviously, Final Fantasy X was her major first game that she really fell in love with. Final Fan- uh, Kingdom Hearts, Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, Mist, Riven, Sonic 2, Spyro, Soul Calibur, Mario 64, Super Mario Brothers, Xenosaga. Yep, Donnie Darko, Mar- Marie Antoinette, Geisha, The Matrix, Fan of the Opera, Fantastic, Many Fair, Sleeping Beauty, Eternal Sunshine, Spotless Mind. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, the Prestige, Little Miss Sunshine, Children of Men. I heart lots of music, alternative, techno in particular. Some of my favorites include The Killers, Hot... Hot Beat, Ayumi Hamasi, OSTs, well, fair enough. Aaron Van Buren, ATB, Snowden, Block Pie, Stills, okay. Actor, Profile, Nina Girl, um, Nina Girl. She's Finnish, Irish, Italian, Spanish, and English. Dirty blonde, blue green eyes. Massachusetts student, fair enough. Okay. So, don't judge me. I live in a little town called Ipswich, and I can't really stand it. Wait, don't judge me yet. I'm not really an I hate life kind of girl. I just would much rather be living in New York City. I love the city life. I plan on moving there for college, which she clearly did. Um, but I live with my mother and two brothers. One younger brother is autistic, so my mom has battled with her local school system to get treatment. This whole deal, deal of my life, but too complicated to explain. I'm a very unique girl, but I'm not really prep punk. I bet she's probably autistic too. Autism seems to run in families, so I wouldn't be I'd be very surprised if she wasn't um didn't also have autism. Also based on what we know about her and her um social ineptitudes, it, it would very much um paint the picture of undiagnosed autism, so fair enough. Um very artsy, I kind of an exile. I love to wear brightly colored clothes, cutesy arts things. That reminds me, I I had a partner back well, multiple partners obviously, but there was one particular partner I think of back in the day. Um probably would have been with her around this time of my life and essentially um she ended up being diagnosed autistic as a few years after we broke up which was interesting so yeah anyway i uh, love photography hot five showing fish canon i especially love taking portraits and my specialty currently going to senior high year high school treating me well i plan to go all my future um planned out i want to go to college i plan majoring in acting or theater you know english photography yes yes I'm a successful actress. I'm not going to become a photographer. Maybe an English teacher. I'll see how I feel in 10 years or so. Oh, no matter what I do, I plan traveling over the over the course of my lifetime. I want to travel to Europe and Japan. Okay. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Why am I continually looking through this stuff? Like, I just find it so fascinating. Look through people's stuff, okay? They're like, <laughs> you give me the ability to look through people's stuff, I'm going to look through people's stuff. Like, it's just fascinating to see what people are talking to. Hot so far, only girls in Russia comment on specifically on my boob. didn't really know so uh, obvious. What can I say? I have nice boobs. So I sent Essa to tell... And she's like, I'm mad at you. Double take. What the hell's wrong? Uh, she was mad because Russia was checking out my boobs in the photo post. And apparently he, like, a dumbass commented them to her. She got mad. Didn't say it, of course, but I definitely want to be like, why the fuck are you mad at me? Jealousy issue. Didn't expect drama for this photo. I mean, did you, how did, what did you post exactly? Uh, Valmeri, which has been gnawing my soul since I bought it. In 2005, right page of 15, I picked up the game World of Stranger, changed my life forever. I hate to think of video games being life changing, but that's the truth of it. I really recall not being intrigued on it first, but seeing my friend's house and seeing it was all I could think about when they bought it. I seen it seemed kind of boring till Mel let me play her character, player character. Walked around, and actually ended up talking to a real player, Reza, and then I got really excited. I was pretty much hijacking the game from Mel and chatting away. I was silly, I was determined to play this game after that. It was so much fun talking to those random people, video games, and the prospect of making new friends. How could I resist? I mean, fair enough. Hey, Nina, this is Al. Becca gave me a stream name. I'm here at the dorm. Hey, have we met before? Uh, we're all similar kind of friends. I've been in the same room, just, you know. Ha, <laughs> fair. So what does Nina um, Freeman do besides being a cutie? Hobbies, jobs. 
Uh, you know me, I'm at work now. I work at the CS department. Um, just hanging around playing Val to Mary. It's empty today. Um, what do you do? Eat donuts. No, JK, I'm a student aide. I want to tell you something funny. I had a dream that you and my friends are celebrating beef. Some dudes, the dudes were trying to see you naked with binoculars. Then the British police came and instead of arresting them, they just yelled your name and ran. Uh, what? Yeah, I think it's my love beaches, great butts, and being total perb. My rational fear of the British police. Okay. Me. Becca! Hi! Oh, haha, -ha, man, I need a break from partying. My liver is going to fall out. Uh, what? I thought you were playing uh, Val to Mary last night. Uh, no, it's going to get stressed about Blake. He's so back and forth sometimes I can't tell what's going on in his head, so I decided to bring him out. Uh, I got epically trashed. We had like 12 people in Mal's room pre gaming. And I mix vodka with te tequila. Bad, bad idea. I don't get sick, thankfully, because Heather bought me a sandwich at 1 a.m. Went to party long saw the bricks and then smoked on the on some rooftop. Then we went. We were going back to the back in the white um, dress party. She was pretty tense. So many people were going. My period, though, it sucks. It hurts. I ran some girls from high school while I was drunk. And there was this guy I'm friends with. One of them was making out with him, and I freaked out so ruffle. Then they made me take a picture of them. It's so funny. I was so wasted. I think and said some fucking something and then high school girls were like, whoa, Nina, I can't handle you uh, swearing. It's too weird. I was like, LOL, okay, you have no idea. Ew, I hate my girls from high school. It's so awkward. Anything else happen? Uh, I don't think there's anything else worth updating you on. Just usual insanity. I had to work from 5 to 10 every p every weekend. But besides, between that and partying, I'm going to die. I have many plans of Blake to play Bra Val Tamari, so I'm going to be busy. So I'm guessing that must be his name. Right? That must be his name, I guess. Remember when you went stage to that weird orange ceremony last month and you struck your phone in your bra? Yes, I'm going to do it. I'm going to stick my phone in my bra and go and stage that um, poetry mo award. Uh, good. I was terrible at the stage, but it was okay. Following your footsteps. Um, Putting your phone in your bra. Yeah, those are my footsteps. Oh my god, who am I? Ugh. Anyway, meanwhile. Um, LOL. I need to paint my toenails. That's all I can think about. All I can think about how badly I want to have sex with Blake. Yeah, then he's going to come to uh, New York City. I know, maybe he's going to call Cali, LOL. Okay. Oh my god, I slogged the fellow manager to play Eurovel because it just came out. Yeah, you like it? It was cool. I was hanging with the crew and itchy and he wouldn't shut the fuck up about you. Uh, really? Stop pretending he doesn't like you. He obviously does. I guess so. I know. I've never liked someone it's pretty, so much. I'm pretty nervous. Well, if I'm just reading him, I know. Don't want to mess this up. You'll be fine. He definitely likes you. Hmm. So maybe Blake isn't itchy? Weird. So who's this? Who's this Blake person? Okay. Can I not open these? It's not letting me? <laughs> ah, that same art style that pretty much every um, person that age bracket does. Yep. Can I go to that website? No. Okay. Once again, as I said, I um won't continue this playing this now, but I don't know how long it's actually got left on. Maybe we should find out how long to beat Sibyl. How long to beat Sibyl? How do you even spell this? S C I B E L E. 1.5 to 2 hours to play in full. It's recommended you play in one sitting. Okay, then I guess I'm going to stop this and start again, and I'm just going to keep playing it, I suppose. Like, if it says I recommend you play it in one sitting, then I better play it in one sitting, huh? Which means this is the end of my Mountain of Shame, and I guess next week there'll be two part twos. Or one. I don't know. I haven't actually done the math uh, on what when these will be posted, but I already have the pe second half of Sumeri either, po Sumaya, either posted or posting soon. So, okay. Yeah, it does say recommend to play in one sitting. Should I just play through this entire game? Yes, one and a half hours is long. Okay. Let's just keep playing then. I don't want to. I don't want to ruin the impact for you or them. But if you want to go, go for it. I'm just going to play.
<sighs> so slow. Do I have to answer him? I'm sorry, I missed your call last night. It's okay. Ichi never said about you. He was gushing about how chill you are. I kind of like it actually. Want to do a run together? Yeah. What happened yesterday? When I logged off, some school friends wanted to hang out. Lame. Okay. Ooh. I feel there's an illusion of choice going on there, but fair enough. Oh god, this game looks so boring. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's accurate to what it is. Yeah, once again, attack to bring out the mini boss. Bloody hell. Okay, so a pretty generic MMO, really. Catch up last night was the best. Brad did end up calling me. He apologized for being such an ask. Ugh, LOM, LMAO. I wish he'd just leave me alone. He really doesn't get that we're done. Want to hang in tonight? I have no homework. I don't see him respond to those, though. They basically wanted to gossip about poetry class and their recent breakups. It took forever. Shitty. Yeah. I've never even had a boyfriend. Serious? Yep. You're so hot though. <laughs> you always say that. It's true. You're like the only guy on earth that thinks I'm hot. <laughs> Wait, but wasn't there a whole storyline before about <laughs> Okay. All right, let's keep going. What about your breakups? Nada. Nada. I've never had a girlfriend. Wow. I'm pretty I'm sure I trust him, but okay. Don't be. I'm a total loser. <laughs> no. I mean, self-deprecating humor is pretty common, let's be honest. But it depends on what the point of it is. I mean, it's never good, I suppose. But sometimes it can be more sincere than others. In this case, it might just be trying to get into his pants. Or her pants, I should say. If I had to end up censoring a bunch of stuff in this video too, I'll be very... I mean, not surprised to be honest, but let's, let's just, yeah. Nice hit. Chill. Like you're down to low and log on runs whenever he said you get shit done. Okay. And it says, what's that? Like you're down to do that? To, uh, I've been getting online for every run lately. Okay. I mean, if this guy's entire life is just this one game, and let's be honest, this game looks pretty, um. Yeah, basic. I do question how. Okay, got another email come through. Let's see. New post on Blue Snake forum that you're following. Real life pictures. Click it if you. Um, favorite of mine. Moment. Okay, so it's itchy again. Post 689. See, this is the thing though. Why would he be posting all this stuff while playing games? It, it shows you how boring of a game it is when people can just send posts and do chats. Crush on you if we'd met sooner, honestly, in like high school or whatever. Yeah. 
No guys ever liked me back then. I was too nerdy. Well, yeah, but nerdy is good. <laughs> yeah, nerdy is good. That's why I went online, because I was in a, on a small town, I was looking for people with shared interests. Like, it, it, what, back then, nerdiness wasn't cool. Blake. Ah, okay, so it is the same person, gotcha. Do you think I did good in Torso the other day? You did good. Why do you always ask me if you're good at the game? You're way better than other girls in the NBA. Oh. Other girls. I didn't like that way of framing it. Not that great. Better than the other girls. Oh, no. <laughs> Do you talk to anyone else offline like this? Yeah, I'm wondering about that myself. No. You? Oh. What? Fire has shown me a picture of you. One of the is, no, he said it was a special one for a while ago. Oh shit, someone's been sharing nudes, gotcha. Oh no, as I thought. Wait, I, can I actually book this? How does this work? Wi-Fi on demand, wait, Wi-Fi at this, at the, in this year? 2009? Damn! On demand food and drinks, live movies, TV, that sounds actually pretty great. I kind of wish we lived closer. Yeah, being on opposite coasts is best for hanging out. I was on the opposite side of the world to a bunch of my friends. I mean, I guess I can understand. Like, this is what MMOs are sometimes like, and that's why I didn't like them in great amounts. Want to meet up with me? Like, in real life. If we lived closer? Pacific time, you wouldn't always be online when I woke up. I like chatting with you first thing. <laughs> oh. That is also true. Um, time zones work very well. Talk to you, though. They're all fucking idiots. <laughs> you always say that. And why are you playing this game, man? Lenore is way cooler than me. Nina. Have you ever seen her picture? No. Why? <laughs> she sent me one the other day. Oh. Really? I don't like how shallow he's being. Ugh. My face is pretty normal. Wow, she's being pretty well to talk like this. Yeah. <laughs> he's doing pre she's doing pretty well at keeping her cool when that guy's just texting her about that. That's true. She was. I look more like my dad, though. Oh, yeah? <laughs> yeah. My parents met on the beach. Sounds sweet. <laughs> it's ridiculous. My mom was walking down the beach in her red bikini when my dad saw her from his boat. I guess he was like, whoa, check out that babe. So he left his friends and swam in to talk to her. What a dude. I know. He asked her out on a date. She was really impressed that he swam all the way in from his boat to say hello. So she said, okay. That's a... Uh pretty crazy story isn't it i'm not nearly on that level with girls i'm shit at talking to people in general really you're so good with people in the game the real question is who was it that sent this especially from a while ago well you hope it wasn't him that shared this this uh, intimate picture but who else would she have sent it to Oh no. Okay, no, good. I met up with Dredge once, like, in person. Talking to him didn't feel all that different. Yeah. But you, <laughs> you're way too hot. I wouldn't even be able to breathe near you in real life. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> I think you're giving me too much credit. Ah, okay, so it's not the same person. Ah, I see. 
So obviously that other person is just an asshole, full and through and through. I'm sorry. Doesn't matter how good you were. You don't ever share pictures like that. The fuck. Me too. I like talking to you, like, a lot. Well, at least this guy's got to be better than that last guy, I guess. But still. I hope. I don't know. Me too. So you can be sitting next to each other doing the same thing on the computer? I mean, there. What? Hugs would be good. Oh, talk. Just us. Huh. Yeah, I think about doing that sometimes, and I would love that. This is fairly reali realistic in some ways, though. This is the sort of silly conversations you have sometimes when you're that far away from people. And it would be nice. And it has been nice. I went to um, see someone who I knew online. Um, I went to Europe to see them and then they came here to see me and it was it worked quite well for like three years until it unceremoniously broke up. It's quite a good relationship, all things considered. I, yeah. Most online relationships though just don't seem to end up with that. Yeah. Alright, I guess we're going to swap forward a few more, oh, jump forward a little bit longer. I really hope I'm wrong about this itchy person. What would happen if we met? I think, you know. Tell me. I'd kiss you. Do you think we could have sex? Oh, I hope he's not a catfisher. Nina, I think I love you. I mean, if they, they haven't even been together. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear, 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 dear. What's going to have happened when we get back? Oh god. Do I want to click on these photos? Are they going to be? Are they going to be completely okay? That's just. All right. So, we've got some selfies still. Pretty sure that some of these are the same pictures from before. That one's new. That one's cute, to be honest. Fair enough. There, okay. We've got some regular pictures. LOL Kiro. Aww. Wait, does that mean... That's a photo he's taken. LOL Hangover. Rocky. Aww. Good boy. Blake Beach. Okay, so they clearly did meet up because these are pictures that have been clearly taken. Okay. I mean, to be honest, oh, I mean, fair. That's exactly the sort of pictures I take. I, I mean, I've literally got a picture of me right next to a fish tank with uh, someone to, uh, like, a, uh, uh, like a, yeah, it's like a puffer fish. Oh, no, actually, no, it's her right next to a puffer fish. And it's like staring at. It. Next one is, um, Basically, one it was one fish, and it's like multiple fish. It was a pretty great picture. Not gonna lie, there were a lot of fish involved. It was pretty great. Um, those pictures are pretty great. Let's be honest. Um, high school, they're all gonna be the same. Old flash drive. Ooh, or not? What's this? Those look different. Earth braces. I mean, she... why were you taking those pictures in high school? I mean, I guess it's not just a little bit skimpy, but it's not really. Okay, now that one, I see. That must have been the pictures that the other guy sent out. I see. I see, I see, I see. Gotcha. So that must have been the past relationship guy who's more of an arsehole. Damn, we don't know how big of an arsehole he is. Let's have a look at this. Oh, God, how much worse are these going to get? Okay, fair. Okay. I mean... <laughs> gotta say, he's a lot more... Um, I shouldn't be laughing. Like, he... Uh, his, his body definitely is probably better than mine, but like, it, I, I, I just, it's a weird picture, okay? 
Also, that one wasn't in the Blake folder before. Okay, fair enough. All right, selfies new. Let's see, downloads. New bow, okay. Homework notes. Okay. Final Fantasy XI, which is an online game, so isn't it? Yeah, Final Fantasy XI was an online game. Did... Hissy's coming out next week. Want to play on a release date? Yeah, let's do it. I haven't seen you online much lately. Yeah, I know. I mostly only play on breaks online these days. It's getting pretty busy, you know? And I know. And now that Blake and I talk on the phone so much, I don't need to be on Val Val Mary. Talk to him. You guys official now yet or what? Nah, labels are dumb anyways. Ooh, I don't like that. So basically, she's in a relationship with him, but they haven't made a relationship, which means it's code word for he can continue to be an asshole around. So I'm, if this turns into a cheating story, okay, once again, I shouldn't be so judgmental. I just don't trust this guy, okay? Ugh. <laughs> Labels dumb. Anyway, did you ask him why he didn't steal the deal? It'd be your boyfriend. No, it's awkward. No, it's not. It's something you should ask. You have the conversation. What do you think of Brad? Oh, geez. Me, lol, lol. No, I'm not looking going to party this weekend on Facebook and talk about who you should date. Uh, I mean, he's all right. I think he's adorable. You should go have a crush on him. I mean, Kyle is priority. Ha 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 ha. But Brad is cute. No, no, no. There's too many dudes. Way too many dudes right now. Ha ha. I want, I want you and Brad to make out. No, yes. I don't want that. Fine. Okay. That since you met me is, is cute. I took some pics and Blake said so cute. Nice. But that's here and I'm feeling gross. Like, I look gross. No, no, no. You're not. Oh, God. It's it's surprise that you and Blake get along. You're both so self-deprecating. Yeah. What do you mean over this? I always end up liking self-loathing types. Haha, <laughs> I don't get it. Me, I've had the same problem, low self-esteem. It's like something we have in common, as weird as it sounds. Yeah, he sounds to me that way. I'm good, I guess. I know. I'm still having a hard time trusting him. Okay. So it's website, so I have an indefinite hiatus, and I don't think I'm going to upgrade WordPress more often. So many things to talk about, but I don't understand to write it all down. Between Blake, Beltamari, school, I don't have much time to let alone take over my websites. Website, sir. Okay. Um, Blake and I are doing well, though. It's actually worth it. Actually, my friends are pretty jealous that I spend so much time with him and Beltamari or on the phone. Becca was like, oh, of course, now you have a guy. You, you just ignore me. Hurt my feelings. I'm ignoring her. I've just been so busy. Honestly, I want to talk to Blake all the time. I really love him. What's he expect me to do? Anyways, I have a class now. Professor just got here. Oh dear. Okay, so her whole life is doing that. I mean, doesn't look like anything's being necessarily negatively. Heh. Yep, okay. Ask Becca if you can take your mum that's staying with her for a week. Ask Blake if you can stay with him. That's his difference as well. I just, I, I, everyone knew where I was going. And that's a very important thing. If you're going to meet someone from online, you need to make sure that every party knows where you're going, what you're doing, and that you remain safe. Right? So everyone needs to know what's happening because you don't like, while I'm one that does believe that you can be in love with people online, you do need to be, um, yeah, you do need to be a little bit careful. Okay. Cause you never know what something's going to, what's going to happen, you know? I, obviously the videos had to be recorded at a later date, but I wonder if the pictures were actual pictures that she took um, back in the day or if they're just new ones. I can't tell. Not very good telling what people... Let's go back from visiting NorCal. Sorry I couldn't call you all week. I missed talking to you. My friend kept me busy. You told me to get, get a pic, so here it is. Warning, it's dumb. See you online later. <laughs> Fair enough. I mean... I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this so far. This guy. I know it's not my my place. I this is a, it's a virtual. It's a character in a game. Okay, let's go. Sabelle, so let's go kill another in, uh, uh, exactly identical boss fight, so I can get a, a, a an idea of if your relationship's healthy or not, and judge you accordingly. Morning. Up. Oh yeah, did I still talk to that person? You really want to do he serum? Isn't it like 5 a.m. there? Yeah, I've been up for hours. It's chill. Wow. <laughs> do you ever sleep? You 
said the other day that you'd think about living on the west coast alone. Like, near me? Yeah. It would be so cool if you could come hang out with me and my real life friends. Austin and Andrew? Yeah, we could just go chill at the beach or something. <laughs> Do you think they'd like me? Don't you get along with everyone? <laughs> Maybe. Oh wow, what the f- Ugh. I'm getting some repetition from this. Alright. But this is a story-based game, so that's fair. And apparently I'm pretty good at talking to people. This fly is sold off. They shouldn't look like two seconds ago. What if we met? God. You want to? Yeah. I mean, you told me that you love me. I'm yeah, and then you didn't even make a relation. You didn't even start a relationship. Like, for how much he's like, yeah, you gotta be super efficient and all that. I'm just clicking on the thing that's really far away. Kind of rejected me. Rush told me to see you're cute. Who's Russia then? You two totally fucked. Uh, no, they haven't met up yet. Thank you very much. And it doesn't even sound like these people are into anything so, more sordid. What do you think? Meeting. I want that. But I also want no relationship whatsoever. Ugh. Be single forever. It's comfortable. I That's not yeah. right. Wait, what do you mean? Relationships are attempts at living in normalcy. No, that's so oh. social, so those normal relationships. Don't fit my lifestyle. But you don't have to have a relationship like everyone else. How can you be antisocial? I don't know. I just don't think relationships are comfortable. Uh huh. I've been in one. So how can you know that? Yeah, and every relationship's different. I'm less antisocial and more. I don't trust this guy. Connections. I don't trust this guy one bit. How did this happen? Like, how did he become so broken? Yeah, that's a good point. Ooh, why wasn't I in class just now? I just missed class? You told me you loved me two months ago and you've been telling me that every day since. How have we been talking on the phone every night? Like, or... Yeah, that's pretty much relationship. Oh god, this guy's an asshole. Since when were you confused? Yeah. Blake. I really care about you. I wouldn't if I were you, honestly. Also, are these errors? They look like they must be errors. I think we need to see each other in person. Because it looks like the paths are still going down there, just not loading correctly. I do want to meet you. This can work. Or not. I can walk around these black squares, so maybe... I... Nope. If we met, though, do you want to, like, really spend time together? I mean... Are we... Duh. Kiss oh. Like I mean, you got to know each other first. Do you want to? Yeah, I think so. Me too. 
I don't trust this guy. Now, if nothing ends up going but wrong with this relationship, and I'm gonna feel like a real jerk for doubting it this whole time, and 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 show how pessimistic I've gotten. I feel attracted to you physically. Yeah. If we met, I probably couldn't help it. I'd want to kiss you. Yeah. And. Whatever stuff. I don't know. <laughs> I get it, Blake. I think the same thing. Oh, what? Just froze? Excuse me. The game just froze. Also, the resolution is tiny. Don't crash on me, please. Okay. Uh Come on. Um let's see. Freeze. Game is freezing. Random freezing. Here we go. No, I'm saying random freezing. This is not really that. It's just completely dying on me. Let me pause and refresh, see what I lose. All right, I'm starting the recording again because we're almost at the point. There we go. I think that's pretty much the line we we, we stopped off at before. Or didn't hear before. Wait, really? Are you serious? I haven't. So we... Uh... I... I told you relationships are weird for me, so I've just never been in the situation before. yeah i totally get it it's crazy to me though because you're like super hot i'm a skinny ghost dude girls do not want to fuck me <laughs> i don't know skinny dudes are very likely to want to be fucked like more than overweight guys Ooh. it could happen uh, well, we could have sex for the first time together. I didn't trust this guy. Do you not like that idea? Physically, yes. Mentally, I'm. This guy's just a. This guy's kind of just an asshole. Used to immersing myself in this game. I don't like oh. about dealing with people in person. This guy's just an asshole. I know, I'd have to figure out how to be... How to feel normal about it? I don't know. Also, as you can see, the um, it was a graphics error of some description. It's not just in the game. I rely on the game. I don't trust this guy. I think he's... I think he's leading her along. I don't know about real life. So Trying to relate with her. I am too. I don't know, like, what's coming. I'm not nervous. I'm just not used to this. It's weird for me that I like you this much. Yeah, right. I'm really glad you feel that way. That I feel weird? <sighs> that you like me. I told you, Blake. I love you. Nina. Yeah? Far away from whoever, just us. I really have no idea why I feel like that, but maybe it could happen. I want that. I don't want a relationship, but I want you. I don't know. Please, let's. I still don't like that. He's not. He's not. Face to face. I don't like the idea. Is it's like no, I don't want to be held down. Like I don't trust that. And then he'll probably turn around, find someone else, be like, well, we weren't together. I'll come. I'll 
I'll ask my mom to buy a flight to New York. I'll tell her I want to visit my cousins there. Really? You think she'd believe you? Yes. <sighs> okay. You can stay with me. I live in a dorm here, so you could just stay, like, here. Okay. So, you really mean it. We're doing this. Yes. I don't know. I wish I had the character that floated. That's a lie. You expect sex. Been talking for a long time in the game, so it makes sense logically that we should meet. We should. Yeah. God. I know. Also, this game is... I'm, I'm doubling down on the fact this game looks terrible. Like, this gameplay loop is not fun. Like, grind, grind, grind till a boss comes up, which can't damage you. Disappears after a while, then you have to grind, grind, grind some more. Yes, I realize the limitations of this small game. I'm not having a go at this game itself, as in Sibyl, or whatever this game's called. <laughs> It's just like, this is the worst MMO I've ever seen. Like, the game itself is fine, but the MMO side of this thing... I, love you too, Nina. I don't trust... doesn't trust this guy. One month later, so are they together? Is it after? Like, they haven't been together very long. Okay, here we go. <laughs> yes, yeah, uh, so much romance in their first hug. I'm sorry, when I when I met my the person I went over to see, we ended up having this silly little thing running around the school and hugging all over the place just because... They're just going straight back to their room to him. Wow. And I mean, I feel like it would be very easy for the mom to call these like, cousins and be like, hey, did blah blah show up? Has she also not changed her... Oh, she, it's only be a year, but still. Oh, yeah. He's already gone. Like, he's being way too smooth for someone who's apparently never done it before. I'm sorry, that is way too smooth for someone who's never apparently done anything before. Like, she she can tell, but he's just like... Oh, no, he's, he's smooth. He's just... I don't know. I don't trust it. I know, it's happening, it, it seems like it's happening way too quickly for... Am I gonna have to... I, don't, don't make me um, censor anything, please. And again, I don't know, I don't know how I feel about this. About him. And will they still be together after this? I don't know. Will we find out, or is that just the end? Do you think we'll ever see each other again? Nina, I had fun, but... I fucked up. What? What do you mean? I shouldn't have come. I knew I shouldn't. Blake. What are you talking about? What an asshole! I don't love you. What? We can chat. I've got to catch my plane. I'll see you online tomorrow, Nina. I'm sorry. 
Wow. Couldn't have seen that coming. He was just using it for sex. What an asshole. And making her feel bad in the... Oh, is it freezing again? Nope, this is the end. Is that literally the end end? It hasn't frozen because last time it did that window, a small window. First of all, it's very confusing things and it really hurts. Maybe I have my view. Ugh, fuck that. That guy was an a-hole. Came there, slept with the girl, left, never seen, sorry, each other again. I'm sorry, when I went overseas, I stayed with her for a whole month. We didn't actually do it straight away. We was like several weeks in before we did it the first time. We had a lovely trip. We went to zoos. We went to aquariums. It was lovely. And I mean, I've met other people from online before and I wouldn't just, you know, fuck them and then leave them. That's terrible. I'm sorry. This, 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 Arr. I don't appreciate seeing, seeing a relationship like that play out. It was, it was relatable up to a point, but he was an a-hole. Ugh. Oh, well. I assume this is a story of her, uh, one of her first uh, times, so makes sense. Uh, I do feel sorry for her though. Yeah. Good game though. Like, it was, it was a good idea. I like this sort of story. It, it, I saw it was coming the whole time though. Like, it wasn't, a, it was a predictable story from the get-go. Like, he, he, I, I am glad about a few things. It doesn't sound like she was isolated. In that she kept her friends the whole time, which is good. Um, yes, she did hold them at an arm's length, which is a little bit of a shame. But she still went out for part of like to to have fun with her friends and such. It... Ah, far fancy online, self server and far fancy online. So FF, yeah. Okay, so that's why it was FF eleven. I was like, that's an MMO. You'd be playing that, not this. Yeah, she was playing. Five Fantasy Online, gotcha. I can imagine similar love stories are happening in Final Fantasy fourteen all the time. So fair. <laughs> uh, makes me wish I I could bring myself to bring another MMO. It is true, MMOs are pretty good for meeting people, but damn, that's a really not great story. Like, I understand some people are broken and it, and it sort of like leads them to do terrible things, but I think she was just being played. This whole time. I didn't like it. But still, good game. If you, you want to play it, I mean, I don't know why you would at this point. You've watched the whole video. If you want to play it, you've probably stopped watching it. In fact, this is what usually happens. I watch a video, I'm like, ooh, that looks interesting. Now I'll stop watching the video and come back to it later. So if you're, if you're here after having played the game yourself and now looking to validate your feelings with what I'm saying, fair enough. Like, either way, I... These sort of stories are dime a dozen. They're all over the place, and it's very common. Um, and I'm surprised they're actually as old as they were in the story, because sometimes this, this sort of stuff starts a lot, a lot younger. People are very naive when they're um, playing online games in the in the in the early thousands sort of thing. So, yeah, well, it's late thousands, but it, it's an interesting one. Look, I always say, you can meet and have true relationships online, but you've always got to know what you want, you've always got to both agree on what you want, and you've got to both be going the same place. If someone's saying they don't want a relationship, and but they want to harm you, and you do want a relationship, just don't. Just don't. Like, they've got to have the respect for you that you deserve. <sighs> anyway. Well, I'll see you next time. This has been my amount of shame. This has been Spill. Hope you enjoyed it. Goodbye.